Hey guys, so before we get into today's video, I wanted to talk about today's sponsor, which is PDF Element. It is an all-in-one smart PDF editor, which offers the easiest way to create, edit, convert, annotate, and sign PDF documents on Windows and Mac. PDF Element is also the best alternative to Adobe Acrobat and a simple PDF editor to maximize your document productivity. So it's your PDF experience simplified. It's fast and easy to use as it is similar to Microsoft Office, so it will be familiar and the redesigned UI and icons make it simple to navigate so there's no need to spend time learning how to use it. It is also intelligent, convenient, fast, and smooth on PDF editing. You can easily keep the original font and format, edit quickly like never before like on a word processor, and you can use the powerful editing tools as I'm demonstrating here to edit text, paragraphs, images, objects, pages, etc. There is also an advanced OCR function, meaning that you can transform scanned PDF or image-based PDF into selectable, searchable, and editable text. Furthermore, it has a powerful batch process, meaning you can perform batch processes with conversion, data extraction, Bates numbering, watermarking, optimization, OCR, and encryption. It is high speed to save you time and effort, and it's a powerful batch process to support so many different features. Finally, you can convert PDF from or to any other popular file formats like Microsoft Word, Excel, PowerPoint, text, images, EPUB, HTML, RTF, HWP, HWPX, etc. So if you guys want to get the Black Friday deal and spin to win the PDF element for free, check the link down below. But if you just want to go ahead and get it right now, I'm also going to be linking PDF element 7 with 70% off down below as well. So if you want to download it on Windows or Mac, just check out the description for all of the links for that. Hey guys, what's up? It's Alicia. So for today's video, I wanted to show you guys how to make your own banners for YouTube and this way you can get like free templates and stuff and you don't have to be super creative yourself. So it's an easy way to get professional looking banners without spending a ton of money, like paying somebody or having to come up with an idea yourself or ripping it off from another YouTuber. So what I'm doing is I'm showing you guys the website Canva. I believe they also have an app so that you're able to do this on your phone, but it's just easier for me to show you here. And this video is not sponsored by the way, but I do think it's a good site. I've been using it for a while. But anyway, so in order to go ahead and make your YouTube banner, what you're going to want to do is go to the website or the app and you're going to want to type in YouTube channel art. And you see it pops up right here in suggested. You're going to want to click there because if you don't, what's going to happen is it's not going to give you the results you want or the ones that are going to pop up on my screen. Once you're here, you'll see on the left hand side that there are a bunch of different options, as you can see, for different channel banners. So you'll be able to find one depending on whatever you want for your channel. So there are a lot of like abstract ones and ones that are like more cartoony and stuff like this. Uh, there are many different options that uh, are geometric. I like ones like those. You can also add a lot of your own pictures to them. And there are a bunch of like, like this one's really cool. I like that. And they also have like collage style ones. So you guys can see that there are a bunch of different options depending on what you want for your channel. So you guys can see like gaming and whatever. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and select one and then I'll show you guys how to mess around with it and get it to look how you want it to. Okay, so I wanted to edit this one because I think this would look cool. So what you're going to want to do is just click on it in this bar over here and it will pop up on your screen. And you're going to want to go ahead and change the text to whatever you want it to say for your channel banner. So I'm going to put I editing X and editing tutorials. Actually, I'm going to change that to weekly. Okay, now that I have that there and I have... Okay, so now that I have this here, I have a bunch of different options for what I want to go ahead and do. First being the text. What you can do is you can change the size, the font, spacing, and stuff like that. So if you decide you don't like this font, on the side here you'll see that there are like hundreds of different font options and some of them are royal so that means you have to pay, but a lot of them aren't. So if you want to change your font to something funny like this, you can go ahead and do that. Okay, so that's there, but I'm going to change it back to the original or maybe Coolvetica. Yeah, I like Coolvetica. And then spacing, you're able to change how far apart the letters are, which can give you a cool effect if you're trying to go for that. Um, another thing that you guys can do is you can change the color of the background. So if you want it to be like purple or white or whatever color you want so that it matches like the theme of your channel better channel better you can go ahead and do that and you can also change the different colors of these individual blobs here so again if you want to change it to like more of a blue so that it matches your channel theme better you can go ahead and do that 
One thing I want to do again with the text is make it bigger so that it's easier to see. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is click on it and then you can change it based on uh, just going through the menu here. Uh, one thing though about your channel banner is it's only going to be this section here so I'm going to go ahead and move in some of these different design pieces so that you're able to actually see it on my banner because I know that uh, once it's formatted in YouTube it's not going to pop up like this. So it looks kind of weird right now maybe but once you guys will see that it looks a lot better once it's actually uploaded. Okay and so I'm just gonna go ahead and since I'm not uploading it I'll show you guys what it looks like on just YouTube in general. Okay so what I went ahead and did so that you guys can see this better is I added these bars here basically just of the blue so that you can see what it would look like when it's formatted in the YouTube format and I just played around with each of these different images so that this is what pops up when I set it as my channel banner but anyway this is a super easy and simple way to make really good looking channel banners so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and were able to learn something. Again this isn't sponsored I just think this is a good site because I've used it forever. Uh, yeah, so thank you guys so much, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.